Hello everybody, I'm Matthew, also known as King. Uh, I'm going to be going over a little bit about uh, my finances, how I kind of screwed up and got into very, very high debt, but also just a little bit about just me living my life and uh, enjoying myself. This is just an intro video, so this one's going to be a little bit longer because I'm going to talk about how I got into where I got. The rest of the videos are going to be a lot of what I'm doing to get out and the different steps that I've learned to kind of beat what I put myself into. For starters, when I was 18, I got two credit cards right off the bat. I was responsible with them. I only used it for gas. Man, I was I was doing great. My credit score was going up. I was looking at it. And about a six months into it, my credit line increased. And that's kind of where it all went downhill for me. I started to look at it as a percentage instead of a dollar amount. What I mean by that is if I had $300 in credit, but I had a $3,000 account, that means I was only 10% utilization. So my credit score still looked great. And so I looked at it as, oh, I'm only at 10%. I'm in the green. I get to spend more money. Or, oh, I don't have to pay that off this week. And so big brain me decided to get more credit cards because the more credit cards I got, the lower my utilization, no matter how much debt I was in. And so that's when it started to go downhill even more. I uh, opened up probably about seven cards and I used every single one of them until eventually it just kind of topped over on top of each other. And I got very, very far into debt. It also didn't help that I started when I was 18 and I only got to about 20 and a half before I start, stopped getting cards. And so that means all of these cards that I got were all super high interest. So now even though I've stopped, I'm still getting hit so hard because of all these high interest rates. And and that's really what's been the death of me for this. Because now here I am, 22, in a seemingly crippling debt with all these high interest rates. And even though I'm making payments every time I'm on time, only making like $10 a difference on my credit line because my interest rate is so high. I had asked for help. I reached out to my mom and she helped me. I got approved for a consolidation loan and that was a huge impact, but it didn't pay off all my cards. So I have this loan that pulls straight out of my account, which is genius. I don't look at it, so I don't spend it. But now I'm living well above my means, even though I'm spending less money because I'm making less money now because it's coming straight out of my account. And that's where now I'm gonna make the difference. Now I'm changing my lifestyle completely. And that's why I wanna take you guys on this journey because it's not just to share my story or let other people know what I'm doing, it's for me. It's to hold myself accountable through this because otherwise I'll probably stop in a month. But if I post these videos, I'm kinda of stuck doing it and that's really good for my advancement. So I'm cutting down my cost of food. I'm dropping a lot of things that I don't need to be spending money on. I'm eating a lot more at home and what I am eating out is all prepared foods that I'm making at home and taking lunch to work, which has been a huge impact for me. In the later videos, I'm gonna be talking about my plans of investing, the savings that I'm doing and how I'm going to pay down these credit cards as quickly as possible. Uh, I'm also gonna be talking about little life tips that I learned through this process and uh, the occasional just me enjoying myself because that's important. That's important for, for me, my health and uh, overall mentality. So if you guys could stick with me through this one, just help me if I know that there's a, even a small audience watching, judging the hell out of me, it might make me just that more into it to make sure I get this done. But that's not on you guys, it's on me. You're just here watching me do it. Thank you. I love you. Let's get this done.